Hello and thanks for joining us. Uh, my name is Greg Ernie on behalf of the Methven Professionals Real Estate Group of Murrubark, Croydon, Lilydale and Mount Evelyn. Uh, welcome to our market report for uh, the month of, or the period of July through to August. Uh, obviously this time of year, winter is well and truly upon us. Uh, the, uh, the clouds certainly roll in, it's certainly been wet, cold, some very chilly, frosty mornings. But pleasantly I can, uh, uh, can advise that, uh, that the buyers have still been turning out in full force. For the month of June, we recorded 647 inquiries for the month, uh, and this resulted in 63 sales. So, terrific, uh, terrific result. Uh, a lot of people, I guess, think that winter is not a good time to be selling, but certainly at the moment we're seeing uh, great demand and, um, and great activity. For the month of June, we conducted over a thousand buyer inspections. Uh, for that period so you know there's a lot of buyers out there looking uh, we are noticing a, a reduction in the number of properties currently for sale uh, it's probably about 30 percent down at the moment and uh, certainly those owners that have taken the steps of putting their properties on the market during the winter months I think are reaping the uh, reaping the rewards with uh, some terrific prices um, interestingly enough the uh, the values seem to be on the increase we noticed uh, over the last four to five six weeks we we feel there's been an increase somewhere between two maybe up to three percent in values and I'll show you a little bit later on in our report this morning some examples of some properties that we've sold and you'll be able to see uh, the example of, uh, of some of the homes there's a property there in Blueberry Road that we achieved a magnificent price of 420,000 probably only about two maybe three months ago that same property uh, possibly would have been selling under 400. It also should be noted during the winter months traditionally there is always a reduction in the number of properties for sale with people feeling that uh, there's no leaves on the trees, the gardens are perhaps not looking as good as they can, a lot of owners choose to hold off from selling their homes. So with stock levels we're, we're seeing at the moment a down perhaps 30% and certainly for those owners that are choosing to have their properties on the market at the moment it really is proving to be a fantastic time to be selling and this is being witnessed with, uh, with many of the sales results that are coming through. It gives me great pleasure uh, to, uh, to welcome to our show today Robin Moore from More Presentable Homes. Rob, welcome to our show. Thank you for having me. Um, for the last 12 months, the Methven Group has been working with Robin. Uh, Robin was actually a, a vendor of ours probably about, uh, about two and a half years ago. Yeah, that's right. And it's fair to say when we all went through Robin's home, she had it looking absolutely spot on. It was, the presentation was just perfect. About 18 months ago, Rob came to us with an idea. Um, you've actually got an interior design degree, haven't you? Yep. Presenting. And came to us with an idea about um, uh, what we would think about if we got Robin in to give our owners or prospective owners as they're coming onto the market advice about um, uh, or tips on getting their home presented for sale. So for the last 12 months, we trialled it initially. Uh, and uh, after a couple of months, we made the decision uh, that every property we would put on the market, that we would get Rob uh, in and, uh, and give those owners some tips on, uh, on how to present their home. So, Rob, welcome. And um, can you just probably, I guess, just give us a, a little bit of an overview of what you do when you go into someone's home? Yeah, okay, so more presentable homes, obviously I want people's homes to be more presentable for sale. So at the end of the day, I want them to get the um, best possible price they can for the sale of their home. So doing a little, a few small things um, to improve the look of their house um, will add dollars to their pocket at the end of the day. And it's, what's the reaction from owners? Because I, I dare say, I know, um, you know, we, we obviously speak to a lot of property owners and everyone's very proud of their homes. How do some owners go when you come in and you, and you say, well, maybe move that picture or don't have that there, how do they find it? Yeah, look, look, they're pretty good. Most people say after my service, they say, I was so nervous about you coming today. I um, was really worried what you might tell us to do to our house. But once I've built a rapport with the clients and by the time I've left, they're very happy that the small things and the small details that I've asked them to look at fixing or moving, um, they're very happy to do those things. And I, I think, and this is the thing the owners under, understand certainly once you've left, is that it's in their interest as many things as, right. as they can do. Uh, obviously it helps us as agents to be able to make the property more saleable, but certainly it helps the owners get better dollars for their home, doesn't it? Definitely, yeah. yeah. So you go in and what you just leave a, a sheet or just sort of little points of things that they should, they should do? Yeah, what I do, I walk around the house with the clients, I get them to show me around and have a good look around, and then I go around on my own and fill out reports that I have uh, pre-printed, and I just fill in the blanks for their particular house. So yep. if I think they need to take the netted curtains off the window to let more 
lighting or clean the skylight, maybe paint a wall, um, a few little pieces here and there yep. to add appeal to a wider group of buyers. Sure. And we're in the depths of winter at the moment and there's probably a lot of property owners out there that are, that are probably thinking, well, we don't want to put our home on the market yet or in another month or two or three months we're going to. What would be some of the, the tips that you give them uh, in the lead up that they can start to get organised to get their home ready? Look, start looking at the finer details, I guess, of the house. Um, the garden, obviously, is very important. We need our first impressions to be spot on. Yep. So first impressions from the street. Um, we also need our first impressions on the internet to be right. So I actually look at the house from a photo point of view as well. Um, things that they need to work on, maybe mulching the garden, letting as much light come in those windows as possible because it is pretty dark and yucky outside. Yep. Um, yeah, just little bits and snippets like that. That's if right. they need to do any handiwork, get onto that now before it gets launched on the market. Great, and if there's a property owner out there that is considering moving, how do they organise for you to come out? Okay, they just get in contact with the Methven Group, so the four, somebody from the four offices, and they'll put you in touch with me. It's part of the service now through uh, the professionals that they get my service included if they're selling their home. Terrific. Thanks Rob, thanks for joining us. It's, um, as I say, we've had Robin on board with us now for 12 months and certainly our sales team love having Robin go out because it, you know, the owners, certainly they have their properties uh, presented just to, a, to that next level and uh, it's just the little things and pre presentation certainly counts. So Rob, thanks for joining us today and, um, and uh, look forward to uh, seeing you in the lounge rooms. Thank you. Thank you. How's the market? Well, let's have a look at some recent sales and we'll get a bit of an idea of just what uh, properties are actually selling out there for. Recently, I mentioned earlier, we sold a property at number 19 Blueberry Road in Murrelbark. Quality home, perfect home for a first home buyer. Three bedroom, one bathroom, uh, carport, uh, very neat, tidy home, uh, over uh, an 875 square metre block and that sold for 420,000. So, um, uh, so certainly a, a great price there. For, for really what was a perfect first home buyer's property. The property at 23 Joanne Avenue in Churnside Park created a lot of interest. Uh, a brilliant home, it had three bedrooms, two bathrooms, uh, double garage, but also had the potential there where the property could be subdivided. Created a lot of interest. We put it out to uh, all of our builder developers that we're working with, had a number of offers on the property uh, and ended up selling the home at 471,000. So certainly that highlights the increase uh, all the developers are seeing that there's a bit more value, a bit more buoyancy in the market. We recently sold two properties to um, uh, two beautiful homes soon to be built by Porter Davis Homes. Uh, we sold these properties off the plan, no construction had started at all. Uh, both of these homes on good size allotments consisting of four bedrooms and uh, right in the heart of Croydon Hills, these properties were at 77 Yarra Road, Croydon Hills, just a short stroll down from Luther College. Both sold for uh, in fact above 720000 so uh, great result, certainly off the plan, uh, highlights that for the right properties uh, there are certainly buyers out there. This month, our feature property that we're uh, that we're highlighting that we've currently got on the market uh, is a true icon in uh, in Mount Evelyn. It's the uh, the tennis centre up in Mount Evelyn, the indoor tennis centre, and the address of the property is at 19 to 23 Hereford Road in Mount Evelyn. A, uh, a unique facility. It consists of six full-size courts. It's got a fitness gymnasium, uh, including a large spectator mezzanine viewing gallery. It's got ample on-site parking, and it also has a self-contained two-bedroom plus study residential unit. It's got a huge main road fr frontage of about 5,000 square metres, or one and, one and a quarter acres, and services obviously the outer east and the Yarra Valley. It's a tremendous opportunity, uh, truly is a magnificent property uh, and uh, we're offering this at 1.2 million plus. So certainly anyone that, uh, whether it's a commercial investor or whether someone is looking at uh, perhaps setting up some sort of business, this truly is a great opportunity right in the heart of Mount Evelyn and the Yarra Valley. So that concludes our market report for July-August. I hope you've enjoyed it and I hope you've found the information of value today. As I said, you've met with Robin. Uh, if you are considering a move in the next two, three, four weeks, 
perhaps a couple of months time, feel free to give us a call. We'd be glad to organise for Robin to pop out to have a look at your home, give you some advice, some tips on getting your property ready for sale. In summing up, the winter months, yes, there are upon us, but certainly the market is showing good signs uh, of, of buoyancy. We have seen an increase in values over the June, early, early July period of somewhere between two up to 3%. Stock levels are down currently at around 30%. So realistically, uh, we do feel and are seeing that this is a great time for property sellers and uh, certainly we're seeing this in the prices we're, we're achieving. So on behalf of the Methven Professionals Group, thanks again for joining us. If you are considering a move, please pop in, talk to any of our sales team. We'd love to be able to help you.